we had heard that the formal Dyke March this year was canceled. Do you have any thoughts on that or what it might look like next year? Yeah. Um, so it's not, it wasn't canceled. Uh, it was never planned. And it's very interesting because we're, we're getting all this media attention this year. Um, and I, I think I know some of the reasons that that's true, but it's not been official for three years. Now, people still show up. People still march. You'll hear motorcycles start, you know, around five, six. Um, but it's not been a, an official march as it used to be for, for the last several years. Um, the difference is that, well, one, we're in a different part than COVID, right? So I think people didn't notice as much. Um, but also this year, just very recently, the um, the folks who were still uh, sort of keeping the lights on as far as the Dyke March official board, not this space, but the other one, um, they uh, disbanded. And so um, a new committee has formed on, on the committee. Um, there are five of us. And uh, our hope is to see if we can, I want to say, in some ways, return Dyke March to its former glory. But really, what I want is to return Dyke March to Dykes. Um, and I want it to be different this time. So we'll see. We'll see what's possible. Um, no, there is no guarantees. It's a heavy lift. Um, but we're pretty hopeful. So that's kind of where we stand right now. We're looking at 2025.